10, a new aquarium project could be starting up in Branson after Branson City officials held a public forum on the aquarium at the Borderwalk Tax Increment Financing tonight. Our Francis Lynn attended this meeting and tells us more about the project and what the public has to say. The Board of Aldermen did not vote on this issue. Tonight was just about the public giving their opinions on this project. We are just there to listen to their comments and then the Board of Aldermen will take under recommendation what the comments from the community are when they go to make their decisions next week. Branson Mayor Karen Best says she will not be voting on this TIF project. Technically, by law, I can vote and I can either support or not support it, but I would rather just remain neutral. Tage Sunder with Cavera Partners explains why they wanted to build an aquarium. We've done uh, many, many years of research, done over eight studies, and we come, uh, came out that the aquarium was wanted by both uh, people that are visiting Branson, but also those people that haven't visited in a while. He also talked about the tax increment financing. It means a city would give tax breaks to a developer. That allows the developer to build the project, which the city hopes will bring more visitors and revenue to the area long term. Members from the public also voiced their opinions. Some were in favor of this project. This is as close as we've ever gotten to an aquarium in Branson, Missouri, and I don't believe there's any chance we're going to get another shot at it if we don't take this one. And some were concerned. The time frame that we're looking at for the rest of this property to be developed, I know you mentioned 10 years, but it's taken you five years to get to this point. <laughs> for the small section. The first reading is scheduled for next Tuesday, and then the second reading is scheduled for the 26th for now. In Branson, Francis Lynn Ozarks first.